Good morning all. Today we will discuss about the components of digital image processing system. So let us begin this discussion. So in order to understand the various components required in image processing system, let us take some scenarios. So this is the first scenario and in this project work, we have to identify the red object, green object and blue object in this given digital input image. So in order to perform this project work, we need the following components. We need a input image. This input image, it is nothing but it is my problem domain in which I have to work and in which I have to identify the red color object, green color object and blue color object. Next, we need a computer and in a computer, we need some image processing software like MATLAB and Python with OpenCV. Using this image processing software, we will write some piece of code and that piece of code will give you the output that is the identification of the red color object, green color object and blue color object. And finally, those output data, finally those output images we have to store in some storage devices. These storage devices, it could be the hard disk or it could be a pen drive. Let us take one more scenario. Consider this scenario. You are a traffic police officer and your, and your objective is to count the total number of vehicles present in a traffic. So in order to perform this project work, we need these following components. First, we need the traffic signal. This traffic signal, it is nothing but it is our problem domain. We need a CCTV camera to capture the image of the traffic. Next, we need a traffic analytics center which consists of a digital computer or a digital system. And we need inside this digital computer, we need some image processing software like MATLAB, Python with OpenCV. Using this image processing software, we will write a piece of code and we will write a piece of code we will write some algorithm and based on the and based on that algorithm our algorithm will gives you the output that is the total number of vehicle present in a traffic now that output result you may store in some storage devices or you may share with your client or uh, or you may share the data output data with the competent authority so these are the two different scenario and depending upon the scenario we need different components to perform our image processing project work. So in general, if I have to say what are the different components it uh, required in a digital image processing system. So this is the block diagram. So this block diagram, it represents the various components usually used in an image processing system. So it starts with the problem domain. In problem domain, here you have to specify your target object, the target object, it could be a traffic signal, the tra target object, it could be a seminar hall, the target object, it could be anything. So depending upon the target object, here you have to specify the specified instrument, here you have to choose the specified instrument, here you have to choose the specified camera to capture your target object. The next, it is the image sensor. The objective of image sensor, it is to provide the digital image of your target object. Usually a image sensor, it consists of two elements. One it is called as the physical device. Another one it is called as the digitizer. The physical device, which is sensitive towards the radiated energy by the object and the digitizer, which converts the output of the physical device into the digital form. So to understand the working principle of image sensor, let us take an example. So this example, it is given in the book. This is the light illuminating source. This is our target object from the light in, uh, from this light source, light are incident on this object. And some portion of the light, it is reflected by this object. This reflected light, it is sensed by this imaging sensor. And finally, this imaging sensor will project the light on a two dimensional plane. And as a result, we obtain our digital image output. 
usually in image sensor three types of camera it is widely preferred in digital image system these are the vidicon ccd that is the charge coupled device and cmos that is the that is the complementary metal oxide semiconductor camera so in the description section i will give you the references for all these three kind of camera that is for the vidicon for ccd camera and for cmos camera i will give you the references in the description section next component in image processing system it is specialized image processing hardware in specialized image processing hardware usually we perform the arithmetic and logical operation arithmetic operation like addition subtraction multiplication division usually we perform in order to manipulate the pixel intensity values whereas logical operation like and operation or operation we usually perform in order to select our region of interest in the given digital input image so in order to understand the arithmetic operation and logical operation let us take some examples this project work i made it in python using open cv tool and in this project work i perform the addition operation and the subtraction operation so by adding a particular integer number in a digital input image we can increase the brightness of the image and by subtracting a particular integer number from a digital input image we can reduce the brightness of the image in python we may have in python we have the opportunity we can perform the addition operation and subtraction operation with a particular integer number or we can design a window like this so in this window this is our slide bar by sliding this bar towards the right direction we can increase the brightness of the image that is we are performing the addition operation and by sliding this bar towards the left direction we can reduce the brightness of the image that is we are performing the subtraction operation so in python we can perform the addition operation the subtraction operation uh, with a particular integer number or we can design a window like this next the logical operation again this project work again this project work i made it in python using open cv tool and in it i have uh, in it i have demonstrated the and operation and the or operation and operation it is usually perform in order to extract the common region and or operation it is usually perform in order to extract the union of the two regions after performing this pre process operation the pre process output it is now given input to the digital computer this digital computer could be a personal computer it could be a workstation now in this computer we need some image processing software like matlab and python in order to perform our image processing work in this image processing software we have to write a piece of code and based on this code based on this algorithm the output image it is generated now this output image we can store it in some mass storage device like uh, computer hard disk or pen drive the process output image we can display it on a wide screen tv or we can display it on a projector also the hard copy of the process output image can be generated by using a printer and the process output image you can share it with your client or with the competent authority by using some cloud network so these are the description of all the components involved in our digital image processing system you can describe all of these blocks in your own terms or you can refer this description for the better understanding so today i am going to stop here if you have any doubt if you have any query you can write it in the comment section 
or you can write email to me till then so happy learning have a nice day and thank you all